everything that exists, atoms and cells, energy fields and ecosystems, is constantly processing information. Take atoms, the building blocks of all matter. Each is a universe in its own right, made up of particles, charges and energies, interacting and exchanging information over billions of years. Everything from photons and planets to microbes and mammals is constantly moving to a goal, advancing from one state to another. Consider photons, the particles that make up light. They travel over 5 trillion miles a year and have been on the move since the origin of the universe. Everything constantly causes effects of some kind or another. Everything has the power to adapt to changes in its environment. Everything is mind. Mind is anything that processes information, causes effects by acting either on its own or through ordered laws of nature, moves toward a goal going from point A to point B, adapts to its environment, interacts with other entities. This means that everything around us, quarks, bacteria, trees, bumblebees, hedgehogs, is a manifestation of mind. We live in a metaverse of mind. This is the message of modern science. Max Planck, the father of quantum physics. This mind is the matrix of all matter. Albert Einstein, the greatest scientist of all time. A conviction of the rationality of intelligibility of the world lies behind all scientific work of a higher order. A belief bound up with deep feeling in a superior mind that reveals itself in the world of experience. Nobel Prize winning biologist George Wald. Mind has existed always as the matrix, the source and condition of physical reality. The new story of science also tells us that everything around us belongs to a social network these social networks are created by mathematically structured laws of nature and the actions of various kinds of agents. Electrons and quarks belong to the social network of atoms. Microbes exist in dynamic, complex communities called microbiomes. Fungi create the wood wide web that enables the global cycling of nutrients. Plants belong to a social network of sun, soil, and bees. Ants create anthills, birds fly in flocks, animals operate in herds. Each human being is made up of 38 trillion constantly interacting cells. All these social networks have their own kinds of messaging platforms. An electron's tweet is a photon released when it changes orbits within an atom. Bacteria put up posts through chemical molecules to coordinate attacks on targets. Plants are live streaming with chemical signals via air or soil, warning each other of impending attacks or manipulating insects with neuroactive substances. Insects communicate through emissions of sound and light and chemical odor. Birds use acoustic communication for courting or warning. Their e-commerce includes migrating thousands of miles away to secure food or nesting locations. Fish communicate via sound, and fish social networks help individual fish locate food, evade prey, or mate. Non-human mammals communicate through visual, auditory, and chemical messaging platforms to find food and mates and to fight or flee from predators. The cosmos itself, the metaverse of mind, is a network of networks. We call it the mind field because the users of this network are different kinds of minds. So how does all this translate into everyday life? Let's take a walk in the park to find out. The sun is shining. The grass is green. Sand grains and stones mark the trails. Flowers bloom. Trees and bushes list back and forth in the breeze. Bees buzz around. Squirrels are everywhere. Birds chirp or fly in formation. Dogs sniff their way forward. People talk and walk. What we are seeing here is an array of minds at work. For more information on the Metaverse of Mind, read Metaverse of Mind, The Cosmic Social Network by R.A. Varghese.
You are also invited to join the Metaverse of Mind social network at mindfield.network, also accessible through metmind.com. The mission of the Metaverse of Mind social media platform, metaverseofmind.com, and of its companion book is to recognize, explore, and celebrate mind embedded in nature and in all living beings, and to preserve and protect species and their habitats. The Metaverse of Mind platform enables its users to virtually enter the kinds of minds around us, from microbes to mammals, so as to understand all dimensions of their being and environment and take action in the real world to address threats and crises facing species and ecosystems. 